CSL Limited is a global specialty biotechnology company that researches, develops, manufactures, and markets products to treat and prevent serious human medical conditions. CSL's product areas include blood plasma derivatives, vaccines, antivenom, and cell culture reagents used in various medical and genetic research and manufacturing applications. History Founded in 1916 the Commonwealth Serum Laboratories, an Australian government body focused on vaccine manufacture. Under the first director, William Penfold, CSL commenced operation in the vacant Walter and Eliza Hall Institute building at the Melbourne Hospital in 1918, before moving to its purpose-built Parkville premises in the following year. After ongoing disputes with the Commonwealth Department of Health and its director, John Howard Cumpston, Penfold resigned in 1927 and was replaced by Frederick Morgan. Soon after Morgan's appointment, CSL was drawn into a serious public health disaster when a batch of its diphtheria toxin antitoxin was implicated in the deaths of 12 children in what became known as the Bundaberg Tragedy of 1928. Although CSL's manufacturing processes were absolved, its labeling procedures were seen to be in error, leading to an enduring focus on the highest standards across the facility's production. In 1928, CSL also became involved in antivenom manufacture in conjunction with the snake venom research undertaken by Charles Kellaway at the Hall Institute. This led to the successful clinical testing of antivenene against tiger snake Notechus scutatus bite in 1930, and its commercial release in 1931. In 1934, the research on snake venoms was transferred from the Hall Institute to CSL under the direction of former snake showman, Tom Pambo Eads. This represented the initiation of research at the laboratories, an outcome its directors had been seeking for over a decade. The relationship with the Hall Institute continued until World War II, particularly via joint projects on viral diseases including polio and influenza coordinated by Frank McFarlane Burnett and Esmond Bill Keogh. Keogh played an important role in the establishment of penicillin production at CSL in 1944 a critical wartime achievement, the operation commenced plasma fractionation in 1952. Thereafter the range of antivenoms increased, including those against other snake species such as death adder Acanthophis antarcticus and the taipan Oxyuranus scutellatus, plus spiders including the redback Latrodectus hasseltii and, after much difficulty, the Sydney funnel web Atrax robustus. Much of this work, including the introduction in 1962 of a polyvalent antivenom against all of the major terrestrial Australian snakes, occurred under the direction of Saul Wiener, while from 1966 until the mid-1990s, venom research was coordinated by the eccentric but dedicated Struan Sutherland. Other major achievements of CSL include Early production of insulin for treatment of Australian diabetics 1923. Development of a tetanus vaccine 1938. Development of a combined vaccine for diphtheria, tetanus and whooping cough 1953. Rapid adoption and production of a polio vaccine 1956. Development of a multi-purpose animal vaccine covering pulpy kidney enterotoxemia, tetanus, black disease, malignant edema and black leg 1961. Production of rhesus D immunoglobulin to prevent hemolytic disease in newborns due to Rh factor incompatibility 1966-67. Pioneering heat treatment to protect blood and plasma products from infection with HIV 1983. 
collaboration on development of the world's first human papillomavirus vaccine, Gardasil, building on the pioneering work by Professor Ian Fraser 1994 in 1994, the Commonwealth facility was privatized as CSL Limited. In 2000 CSL doubled its size through the purchase of a Swiss plasma company, the Bern-based ZLB Bioplasma AG. In 2004, during a period of plasma oversupply, the company expanded again with the purchase of the German medical company Aventus Bering. The company was the second Australian public company to have reached a share price of over $100 per share. In 2011, the company received the Minister's Award for Outstanding Equal Employment Opportunities Initiative for their Thinking Kids Children's Centre. In October 2014, Novartis announced its intention to sell its influenza vaccine business, including its development pipeline, to CSL for $275 million. CSL merged it into its BIO CSL operation. In November 2015, BIOCSL rebranded the combined business with Novartis Influenza Vaccines as Sekirus creating the world's second largest influenza vaccine company. Locations <laughs> 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 The company's headquarters remain in Parkville, Victoria, an inner suburb of Melbourne. CSL Bering is headquartered in King of Prussia, USA and has manufacturing operations in the Swiss city of Bern, in Marburg in Germany, and Kankakee, USA. Sekiris has its headquarters in Maidenhead and has production facilities in Holly Springs, USA, Liverpool, UK, and Parkville, Victoria. Topic ownership CSL is a public company and its stock is traded on the Australian Securities Exchange under the stock code CSL. The company completed an initial public offering in June 1994 at $2.30 per share. CSL stock is part of the S&P, ASX 50 index. <laughs> Vaccine for A, H1N1 2009 pandemic CSL's vaccine for swine flu was approved in September 2009 for use in Australia by people aged 10 and over. The federal government ordered 21 million doses of vaccine for 2009 AH1N1 of which 8 million were manufactured by CSL. The Australian government intended to use the CSL vaccine in one of the largest national vaccine programs in the country's history. Topic: <laughs> Divisions. CSL Limited's products can be separated by company division. Some of the key products produced by each division have included Topic Sekiris BIO CSL Vaccines ADT a cellular diphtheria tetanus vaccine Afluria influenza vaccine Afluria quad influenza vaccine Agricole influenza vaccine Comvax Haemophilus influenza type B hepatitis B vaccine Fluard influenza vaccine Flucelvax influenza vaccine Flucelvax quad influenza vaccine Fluvax influenza vaccine Fluvarin influenza vaccine a human papilloma virus vaccine which gained TGA approval in June 2006. HBVax2, hepatitis B vaccine. 
Liquid Pedwixiv, Haemophilus influenza type B vaccine. MMR2 MMR vaccine. Mengelgate meningococcus group C vaccine. Merivax 2 rubella vaccine. Panvax H5N1 influenza vaccine. Panvax H1N1 2009AH1N1 influenza vaccine. Plague vaccine, Yersinia pestis vaccine. Pneumovax 23 pneumococcus vaccine. Qvax, Coxiella burnetii vaccine. Tetox, tetanus vaccine. Vacta, hepatitis A vaccine. Varivax, varicella zoster vaccine, antivenoms. Black snake. Box jellyfish. Brown snake. Death adder. Funnel web spider. Polyvalent snake antivenom. Redback spider. Sea snake. Stonefish. Taipan. Tick. Tiger snake. Pharmaceuticals. Angiomax. Bivalirudan. Licensed from the medicines company. Ostrapen. Ampicillin. Benpen. Benzylpenicillin. Baronex bumetanide licensed from Leo Pharma Divabit calcipotriol betamethasone licensed from Leo Pharma Divanex calcipotriol licensed from Leo Pharma EpiPen epinephrine autoinjector licensed from Day Laboratories Flomaxtra tamsulosin licensed from Estella's Pharma Flopin, flucloxacillin, fusidin, fusidic acid, licensed from Leo Pharma. Minijet system preparations include epinephrine, atropine, calcium chloride, furosemide, glucose, lidocaine, naloxone, sodium bicarbonate. Modavigil, modafinil, licensed from Cephalin. Solares diclofenac sodium in hyaluronic acid, licensed from Almiral Tramol Tramadol, licensed from Grunenfall Venica Eflornithine, licensed from Almiral Topic. CSL Bering, Australia Albumex Serum Albumin Biostate factor 8 Caramune which is immunoglobulin for intravenous administration IGIV CMV immunoglobulin VF cytomegalovirus immunoglobulin Helixate which is recombinant antihemophilic factor a blood clotting factor for the treatment of hemophilia Hepatitis B immunoglobulin Human immunoglobulin, intragam P, normal, Rh D, immunoglobulin VF, sandoglobulin. Monofix VF, factor IX. Prothrombin XHT, prothrombin complex. Rofilac Rh D, immunoglobulin G. Tetanus immunoglobulin VF. Thrombotrol VF, antithrombin 3. Vivoglobin, subcutaneous human immune globulin indicated for the treatment of primary immunodeficiency. This product gained FDA approval in January 2006. Von Willebrandt factor Zoster immunoglobulin VF varicella zoster immunoglobulin CSL bearing Immunology Baroglobin P, human hepatitis A immunoglobulin, liquid 16% solution for intramuscular injection Barirab P, human rabies immunoglobulin, liquid 16% solution for intramuscular injection 
Caramun NF, Sandoglobulin, Sanglifor human normal immunoglobulin, freeze dried formulations for intravenous administration. Cytogam, human cytomegalovirus immunoglobulin. Liquid immunoglobulin containing a standardized amount of antibody to cytomegalovirus. Hepatitis B immunoglobulin P bearing, human hepatitis B immunoglobulin, liquid 16% solution for intramuscular injection. His entra, human normal immunoglobulin. Liquid 20% immunoglobulin solution, ready to use for subcutaneous administration Privigan, human polyvalent immunoglobulin, liquid 10% solution for intravenous injection Rhizogamma P, human anti-D immunoglobulin Prefilled syringes of highly purified anti-rhesus factor DEG for intravenous administration and intramuscular injection. Rophilac human anti-D immunoglobulin. Prefilled syringes of highly purified anti-rhesus factor DEG for intravenous administration and intramuscular injection. Sandoglobulin NF liquid, Redimune, Redimune NF liquid, human normal immunoglobulin, liquid 12% solution for intravenous administration Tetagam P, human tetanus immunoglobulin, liquid 16% solution for intramuscular injection Varicellin P, human varicella immunoglobulin, liquid 16% solution for intramuscular injection Vivoglobin, human normal immunoglobulin, liquid 16% solution for subcutaneous administration coagulation bleeding disorders Variate, freeze-dried human coagulation factor 8 concentrate Berenin P, freeze-dried human coagulation factor IX concentrate Factor XP bearing, a freeze-dried human coagulation factor IX and factor X concentrate Fibrogammon P, clubbert and corifact, freeze-dried human coagulation factor 13 concentrate Helixate FS and Helixate Nexgen, freeze dried recombinant coagulation factor 8. Humate P and Hemat P, freeze dried human coagulation factor 8. C and von Willebrandt factor concentrate. Monoclate P, a freeze dried monoclonal antibody purified human coagulation factor 8 concentrate. Mono 9, a freeze dried human coagulation factor IX that has been purified using monoclonal antibodies. Stomate, a synthetic desmopressin acetate nasal spray. Octostem, a synthetic desmopressin acetate nasal spray pulmonary. Zamira, respreza freeze dried human alpha 1 proteinase inhibitor A1PI, critical care. Alba, Alburex, Albumion, human albumin bearing, albumin R25, human albumin solution, 5%, 20% or 25% human albumin solutions. Berenet P, freeze dried human C1 esterase inhibitor, C1INH, concentrate. Veriplex P, N, freeze dried human prothrombin complex concentrate. Hemocomplatan P, Reastap, freeze dried human fibrinogen, factor I concentrate. Kyburnin P, freeze dried human antithrombin 3 concentrate. Streptase, freeze dried streptokinase wound healing. Veriplast P combi set, fibrin sealant kit, freeze dried fibrin sealant for topical application. Fibrogammon P, freeze dried human coagulation factor 13 concentrate. Takakum, fibrin sealant fleece type, fleece type collagen preparations coated with fibrin glue components. Product availability varies from country to country, depending on registration status. Topic. 
Topic See also Australian Red Cross Blood Service